Hello friends, welcome to TechQuest channel. This is for the tech by your tech. Watch my videos for lab tests and interpretations. In this video, we are going to discuss about target cells. We regularly see target cells in peripheral smear. We'll see what are the causes for target cells and what are the different diagnoses for target cells. Target cells or erythrocytes resemble a shooting target, a central red Red bull's eye is surrounded by a clear ring and then an outer red ring. An excessive ratio of membrane lipid to the cell volume. The cells are thinner than normal. Target cells are also called as codocytes as they appear like a bell in electron microscopes. Because of its thinness, they are referred to as leptocytes. Because of their wavy bowl shape, they are referred to as Mexican hat cells or Sombrio cells. What are the causes for target cells? The obstructive liver disease can cause target cells, thalassemia, hemoglobinopathies like hemoglobin C and D disease, sickle cell disease. After plenoctomy, in some cases, iron deficiency anemia can also cause target cells. The artificial target cells are generally present in some smears that is due to the problem in drying the smears. Artificial target cells are sometimes seen in some smears because of their smear making issues. When they dry the smear, it's improperly dried. In this case, we can see irregularity of target cells present in the smear. That means you will not get target cells in all the field. You will see in very few fields that shows they appear artificially. In thalassemia, usually many target cells are present in the peripheral smear, patient with hemoglobin E and beta thalassemia. An abnormal hemoglobin, the defect is related to the improper distribution of hemoglobin. Microcytic target cells may be seen in thalassemia. Decreased intracellular volume is relationship to the membrane surface in thalassemia that may also account for thinner cells. Thalassemia is a group of recessively autosomal inherited disorder in globin chain production. It is characterized by decreased or absence of either the alpha or beta chains of normal adult human hemoglobin molecule. Target cells are more resistant to osmotic lysis. Clinically, target cells are seen in hemoglobinopathies like hemoglobin C disease, yes or C, and sickle cell and thalassemia, hemolytic anemias, hepatic disease with or without jaundice, iron deficiency anemia because the problem with iron in making hemoglobin as well as after splenectomy because the spleen plays an important role in clearing the abnormal RBCs and also the maturation takes place in spleen. In liver disease, Macrocytic target cells are seen in certain enzyme defect, the cholesterol and the phospholipids are abnormally increased within the erythrocytes and becomes incorporated into membrane lipid and decrease the cellular hemoglobin level. Because of lipid layer, the RBCs are made macrocytic, but the hemoglobin, the content of RBCs are low which makes the target cells appearance. Thanks for watching. Please watch my other videos, like, share and subscribe. Thank you.